what we doing, everyone? My name is Michael Worden, and if you're new here, I gotta say, it's a pleasure to meet you. And well, on this lovely vlog of an adventure, I'm just gonna talk about a few things that I just heard as of this week, something I just accomplished as of today, I am just super excited about, and I can't wait for the near future. And uh, yeah, I wanted to share that with you today. So before I uh, decide to share with you guys today about you know the thing you know with the things that I'm excited about, I want to kind of give you guys like an idea of like where I'm at and stuff. So right here is a nice little machine shop. Over there is a built house and I some abandoned looking no like some some abandoned building here. Oh, some weird looking warehouse. I don't know. Seems kind of spooky. But anyways, let's uh, let's get to it. Let's get talking about the things that I'm a little excited about. So, what am I excited for? Well, just as of this week, I hear that there was a Lego set that's coming out that uh, I'm actually surprised they didn't come out this week and not... I, I'm surprised they didn't come out this week and why they're deciding to wait for it to come out in a month because this is kind of like that time of the year like certain places like you know the the movie studio park you know Universal that this movie you know that, that the that the movie is you know the studio that it's based out of you know um why they're not releasing it now at the end of the day uh i don't make decisions lego didn't send me a memo um you know you know you, you know you guys should put this out like you we all know for sure like if if you work in shipping or you or if you work in a warehouse you kind of know like they have the sets ready to be shipped right now and they can put it on the shelf but god forbid you know that they signed some kind of contract you know saying that you know we can't sell it until Da, 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 da. And I, in my head, I think it would help us out sales, but you know what? Yet again, I'm just an end buyer. I buy the sets, build them, talk about them, when I, all that kind of good stuff. Is the Jaws set, the, uh, the, the, the scene at the end of when the, the shark is starting to attack, and he, you know, the shark is, you know, attacking the boat and, and all that unbeautiful stuff that happens to the captain and the fisherman and all that kind of good stuff. But yeah, I can't wait to buy that set. So on a quick note, I was going to walk more this way, but as I was walking more this way before I hit the record button, there's like, you know, people, you know, some personal property back there and I really can't walk over. I don't want to walk anymore over there. So I'm going to keep walking this way. And yeah. All right. Now, what's another Lego set that I am very well interested in? Well, let me tell you this. This set... I, first of all, I've been wanting a set themed after this, and this theme, or if anything, this video game has been, uh, is very near and dear to my heart, probably just like the many, you know, just like the rest of you, you know, you probably got something near and dear to your heart that LEGO has a theme of, and, you're, and I know you really, really like it, and I can't wait, I was shocked, um... And that is, they're coming out with a Legend of Zelda Deco, Deco Tree Lego set. And I was stunned. I'm like, you know what? That's it. I am getting that set. I am waiting for that set. If anything, I'm not waiting for two sets to come out. Because I got to tell you guys, I've been interested in trying to get, you know, um been been wanting to buy little sets here and there but i i've kind of really lost the oomph for the oomph to buy little mini lego sets right now to build just because i have you know sets that i'm looking forward to getting and plus it's as you guys know the 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 prices of some of these sets have gone up and it kind of just sucks now here is something that i'm really excited about and earlier today you know at the start of five o'clock this morning i did this with my dad and um 
All I gotta say is, 4th of July is over with. All summer holidays are done with. Memorial Day is gone, done. Um, 4th of July is over with. And ever for the past few years, as soon as 4th of July is over with, pretty much in my head, I say, there's no, there is no such thing as August and there's no such thing as September. My head goes straight into fall is coming and Halloween time is upon us. And it is, Halloween is my favorite time of year. I love it. I like it a lot. I was just talking with my dad. You know, he asked me, he was like, you know, what really made you love Halloween? I told him, I go, when I was a young kid, I absolutely hated the fall time of year and all that kind of stuff just because... When I was young and I was super excited for summer because I was I wasn't in school. But then as soon as as soon as fall came around that, that kinda showcased the fact that, you know, I had to go back to school and stuff and no, there's no one behind me. Um and stuff and I kinda just you know, fall had this sour feeling in my stomach and I wasn't a big fan. Well as I got older, um, well, you know, and as you get a job, you know, there's no such thing as you get, you know, a, a summer vacation or anything like that. It's just you work pretty much 100% of the time throughout the whole year. You know, you know, winter, summer, spring, fall. You know, there, there's no, you know, you get somewhere off. I know, you know, in a quick sense, I know some jobs do do that. I know, like, there's a job I saw, it kind of gives you the winter off. But regardless... The fall time of year is my favorite time of year just because it's fun. You know, there's things to do. And and um, the biggest thing that my dad, he got me hooked on was he bought this 12 foot, what they call Scully or Skelly. No, 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 not Scully. D d d d different kind of thing. Um, Skelly, they, 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 they name him Skelly. He's 12 foot. He's a, he was the very first ever, um, what they call, uh, a Home Depot animatronic static, if anything. It just, he kind of just stands there with with cool glowy eyes that kind of looks all over the place. And it's super cool to put together, you know. And, you know, basically he started it. And, and if you're driving around, you're seeing houses with, with these big, huge things. I think they all started with Skelly. And, you know, it, you know, it's what got us hooked. And then my dad saw this really neat... Um, they call it, uh, he's like a five foot groundbreaker and <laughs> funny enough, his name is Rattles. Very neat looking thing. He's a, he's a static prop. Um, and it looks like he's, you know, kind of like coming out of the ground and he's super cool. And so when he, when he very first came out, he was pretty much difficult to get like, like, uh, like the, like the Nintendo switch. But as you know, if you wanted to stop watching this video and go and grab and go and buy a Nintendo Switch, if you had the funds for it, you can go do that if you wanted to. But now he seems a little bit more easier to get. But where we had to go get him, me and my dad, we had to drive all the way out to um to uh, New Jersey to get him, and then come all the way back, and we got him. And he's I, I can't wait to put him up this year. He he's gonna be so cool in our in our yard. And it just makes me a little bit more excited for Halloween and fall and stuff. So that's another thing that I'm, you know, pretty excited about. Um, but, you know, can you guys let me know, is there anything that's exciting for you? You know, are there any Lego sets that you're looking forward to getting? Is there any, are you excited about Halloween coming up? Are you excited about something? It, it doesn't have to be anything related to which, what I said in this video. Is there anything? It doesn't matter. <laughs> um, you know, let me know. Um, but yeah, that's what I'm excited about. You know, you know, Jaws. Um, and then, you know, the Legend of Zelda Lego set. And then, and then, you know, Halloween's coming up with, you know, with all the nifty animatronics. You know, so we're all excited about that. Um, so before I end here, I want to say, I think I messed up the name of what Rattles is. I know I called him a groundbreaker. But Lowe's has a, I think it's a 10 foot and a 10 foot groundbreaker, which is actually like a zombie that, a green zombie that's coming out of the ground. Hence the name why he's a groundbreaker. But 
All I know is his name is Rattles. It's really neat looking. He's a skeleton that's coming out of the ground. But other than that, I'm going to end it here. If there's anything, as I say, it doesn't have to attain to anything to that, that I said here. You, you could be, if you're excited about anything, a trip, something that you're going to be doing with your friends, a video game that you're going to play, I don't know, I don't care. Let me know. Let me know in the comments. Are you excited about anything? Are you not excited about anything? Let me know. And uh, also, YouTube bots, I know you're watching. I know you're listening. So please help push this out. And this is where they also like to listen to me very well, as I, as I should be saying. Like and subscribe. It really does help me out. It really helps out with the channel and everything else. So with that, I'm out of here. So see ya. Oh, also, some stinking duck just laughed at me as soon as I ended. Stupid duck. Jeez.